Welcome to Let's Play F-Zero. This is in commemoration of Castle Falcon being a new Super Smash Bros. game. And as you can see, I already beat the game. That is not no. I want to leave. Let, let me leave. Leave. So, yeah, I already know what to do for all the tracks and whatnot. So this should go pretty smoothly. Let's go ahead and get this going. Now I'm going to be using Blue Falcon for all of the races. Which is Captain Falcon's car. And we're going to start with the Night League and go to Stagger. Now I'm not going to be doing expert at all because no reason. Here. That that's a beautiful start. So this game is notorious for being pretty difficult, from what I know. In all honesty, it's not that difficult. I I almost went the wrong way. Mr. Mr. Samurai Goro King. Now, one of the major things I dislike about the game is whenever you hit anything, whether it be a wall, a... That's... A wall, a... Car, whatever, you go bouncing like a madman. It's kind of terrible. It gets very, very frustrating later on. Now, the B button, if you hold the down, makes you go. After you complete a lap, you'll get a speed boost, indicating if you're bottom right. Hit A to use it. L and R will make you do a sharp turn. And Hulk and Square will give you your brakes, and I don't like you. Oh no. You bastard. Now, if you hold down while going off a ramp, you'll jump higher. I didn't do it there because I don't need to. You have to do it in a race later. I hate you. Now, you saw this to the left. If you run over it, it'll restore life. Yes, you actually have life. Mr. Car Guy? Ugh, I hate these non racers. Lack of mine on. Yeah, I'm away. Oh, that was the last lap. Good. Now, if you run out of power, or if you fall off the track, you lose a race automatically and have to redo it from the start. Now you have extra lives, problem right? And you can actually get points. I don't know how you get points. And after 10,000 points or so, you'll get extra life. And here we have Big Blue. Which we know from Melee mostly. Mr. Guy. And I swear the whole bouncing mechanic is going to get really annoying. And here we have ice, because why not? Give me some health back, because I freaking hate the bouncing mechanic. I'm in third place, that's not good. I don't like how tight these corners are. Mr. Guy.
Now be careful, get too close to the edge, because you will lose life if you even remotely touch it. Hi there, Goro. Hi there, Goro. At least I made that samurai, Goro. He was from F Zero, right? I only know Captain Falcon. That's all. That's only because of Smash. But overall, the game's not that difficult, save for a couple stages. Because of how annoying the levels get. Mmm, help. Oh, why did I do this? I don't know why, but it worked out. How are you ready on my tail? Oh no. You really, really need to be precise with your driving, otherwise you're gonna have a bad day. But overall, for circuit, not that difficult. You should be able to give this just fine. It's a good, it's a good warm-up game. I don't know how F Zero X or G X plays. Ow! So I don't know how difficult those are. And I think that's it. Yes. And because I got 10,000 points, I got an extra life! Wow, I was in 5th place. There are 5 races per... circuit. So, here we have Sam Boosin. I don't recall how difficult this area is. Mr. Samurai Gorm. I'm gonna keep calling you that because I don't know. I I keep thinking that's who you are. Now I'm probably right. Mr. Mr. Guy, I would like for you to get out. Oh. Uh, away. No. Don't bounce me around. No! Oh goodness. I I don't like these turns. There's some turns I have no idea how you're even supposed to do. Oh, you're in the worst place possible. Now I only beat the game on beginner, so yeah. It doesn't seem like it's much more difficult on a standard. For all it seems like, ow, it's about the same. I'm kind of sad that this isn't, uh, a new player. Because, ah! It seems like it'd be a fun multiplayer game. Very frustrating. Very frustrating multiplayer game, but nonetheless. These guys. Oh no. Gotta use the boost to get through, man. If you don't use the boost, you're gonna be in trouble. Now, avoid going into those grainy parts because they slow you down. Someone's right on my tail, and I don't know who. It's okay, it can bounce me or, well, it bounce me, but it can flip me around. Mr. Mr. Whoever you are, stop. Oh my goodness. 
you guys are the worst. And I, I just lost this race. No, I barely got it. I guess why I hate bounce mechanic, because it completely screws you over. I also hate this course. This course is a piece of crap because of the wind. You can't go straight because the wind will push you. And because the wind doesn't push you right, you can't freaking hit the arrows. And good things like that happen. Yeah. Wonderful gimmick, huh? And because it doesn't let you go straight, you get pushed completely. <sighs> like, you can't even go straight ever. It's, it's stupid. It's like really hard to make it so bad. You don't go crashing it and have to break up. And watch out for flashing cars. Hey, hell, explode. I'm surprised I hit both of those. And don't worry, we'll see this stage again later. And I missed that great. Oh. oh no. And I missed it because freaking wind mechanic. I hate I hate the wind. <laughs> Thank you, car, for getting in my way. Final lap, huh? All I need to do is just hit the... And I missed that. That's gonna... That's gonna screw me over. I have to hit this one now. Great. Good. And there we go. We're done with this terrible, terrible level. Ugh. I hate that level so much. <sighs> and here we have the final race of the circuit. I don't think this I don't think this one was that bad. It has sort of turns, but other than that, it's not that bad. Yeah, I remember this now. You have to go this way. Otherwise, you're gonna get stuck in gravel. Then you have silly turns like this. Overall, it's not that bad of... Wow! A course. I don't need to heal. I need to uh, not bounce everywhere, though. Also, be careful not to fly out of the, uh, track, or you will die. Well, that, that's gonna hurt a little. Luckily, there is a healing right here. That was a bad time to use, but... I guess you could hate the sword cut if you have a turbo there. That's not good. I don't know who you are, but Goro. You know what? I'm gonna save this turbo for over here. Let's see what happens. Oh my goodness, there's mines. That's what happens. 
Okay, that was a bad idea. I'm kind of getting hurt a lot. I'm gonna save this again. There we go. That's what you're supposed to do and not what I just did there. I don't know how you're supposed to take that turn normally, so yeah. And there we go! First place! Easy enough! Ah! And that is the uh, night circuit out of the way! Only two more circuits left to go! I'm gonna take some wait time getting through this. No, I'm not gonna guarantee that I'm not gonna game over. I guarantee I will game over at some point. Because some of these some of these um levels get a little bit annoying and unfair. Also, this kinda reminds me of the uh one biker minigame in Chrono Trigger. I wonder if it was inspiration for it, huh? Anyways, that is the Night Circuit down. Next up, as you can see, is the Queen Circuit. And then the King Circuit. Alright. 